Hello there guys, it's the Crazy Grumman here and I am back playing Curse. In the last video, I found out a load more information, had to fight off Eve a couple of times. And she did actually get me. I remember that one freaking the, the, the doorway. Now we're going to head towards the chapel and see if we can take out Edgar. Probably won't be able to. But I'll try. Oh, hi. Walk away then. Eve's having a grand. It doesn't mean she's... Yeah, it doesn't mean she's coming after me. Oh, thank fuck for that. I thought she was going to come out and stop running after me then. This room is full of tables. What are they used for? Dissectioning? Read the note. John did a deep dive into the tubes and scrolls within the cellar library. He found that tomes that describe a ritual that applies a rune to an object. Okay. The bearer of the rune will never know the darkness of death. Okay. Edgar must, must have performed the ritual as part of his quest for immortality. So, would that be the knife then? The dagger of Ad to every room. This must be the dagger I received from the second floor. So that's the one connected to Edgar. If the dagger is required for the ritual, why would Michael have had it in his possession? Maybe trying to take him out? And why would John tell me to bring it to the chapel? They're, I think they're possibly all working together then. Still many questions to be answered. I think they're working together. Oh, hi! And blood from the... Blood from the cellar. Am I gonna... There's something dripping from the ceiling. I know that! Found that out before you bloody said it. Have I gotta look at someone? No? Or have I gotta... Investigate the trap door. This trap door must lead to the conservatory on the first floor. Really? Would it? Bye! The blood trail continues under the entrance door to the northeast room. Okay. And I think the flies need to. <laughs> oh, Nelly! He hasn't attacked yet. I wonder what she's wait. Probably waiting for Edgar. She's probably letting Edgar do it. I think that might be the chapel. That's got to be the chapel. Hence the logo is on the door. What was he doing to people down here? Oh. Old surgical tools. Beautiful. What was this room used for? And what was dragged along the floor from the other room? I don't know. But I think I'm about to find out. Investigate the table. The table has some, some very old blood stains on it. Here we go! Surprise! Hi. You gonna stand up? Another body? No, okay. No, okay. Woo! Woo! Why are you following me? Why are you leading me? Oh, okay. Okay, whoa, whoa. Hi guys, hi guys. Manifestations, plural. We are your I know that. Murder in our guests. Dragged down under the deepest members. And murder to dash. Okay, why? That door is emanating some power energies. Bulk of energy is coming from behind it. That's definitely the source. Well, yeah, hence the the freaking the uh, the logo. Of what we've been seeing around the manor is actually on the door. There's that rune again. The door is unlocked. Of course it is. They want me to go in there because they want me to die. 
Hmm, the power beyond the door is considerable. Okay. This must be the entrance of the jail. Yeah, that's what my, that was my guess. Ages ago. Read the door. This is the way we need to be transformed. I guessed. Where the dead Where the dead Where the Whatever force is powering the cellar is definitely behind this door. Okie dokie, let's go! Into the room of joy and happiness. Sing. Okay. This is interesting. I have seen this room all over the manor and on the parchment in the cellar of the library. The rune must be the mark John previously note, previous note mentioned. But it's a combination of symbols. It's clear now. Edgar made a pact with Lucifer to gain immortality. Oh dear. Made a pact with the devil. Well, that's stupid. Let's get a note. You picked up the note from the altar. John didn't make it. He was being played with the entire time. Edgar and Eve were in complete control. Extending their murder spree to include the entire team. Oh, God. This goes far beyond anything corporate describes. Oh, of course it bloody did. I was not prepared for this. What's dripping on the note? What? Oh, dear. Pouring down, pouring down. I'm where you want me, Eve, so knock it off. The book on the altar. I must confirm my suspicions, and then they can. So then get the hell out of here. This is it. The actual original tone. Okay, so what do I do? Let's get the book. The Ritual Immortalis. You've skimmed through the pages describing the application of Immortalis Rune. Atherton performed this ritual on himself. John was incorrect, though. It wasn't a tattoo. Did he say it was a tattoo? The rune was carved into his flesh by the Atherton Dagger. He did achieve immortality, not in flesh, but in spirit. Oh, bollocks. As well as domi dominion over the dead. Via a pact with Lucifer. His immortality comes at a cost of hundreds of lives. Oh, so he used to... He would kill his guests with a dagger, feeding his rune in the process. Ah, so he was feeding the dagger so he could perform the ritual to become immortal. Then drag their bodies down here to dispose of them. Aha! The cup must be filled with that which it grants. Well, what does it grant? <laughs> Edgar? That came from Edgar's portrait. Hi, Edgar! Okay, Edgar, I'm here. I am pleased to make this far. So that you may know my men and tribes. Yeah. And that you brought my dagger back to me. But as the saying goes, 
All good must come to an end. Yep, so you're gonna try and kill me. I've gotta get out of here. Let me take this opportunity to to my wife. Although I'm sick, you two to already be it. Yep, we have. you're gonna come back again I only have moments before Eve returns I have to figure out a way to dispel her here perform the bat oh the banishment ritual that I did with thingy magic I'll put the protective circle of salt on the floor first oh thank god I don't have to remember it oh now the pantogram of sage in the center <laughs> fuck me we will throw out the chapel. Door slam. Eve's going already. <laughs> Why here? Piss off, woman. Just let me perform the bloody ritual. Graham, you really don't want me to perform this. I don't have time to get a perfective circle made, so I'll have to try something else. What? There are definitely four power sources here. I need to remove them from the equation. But what are the power sources? I don't know what the power sources are. Oh, the tablet. Oh. Confront the ruin in Mortalis. Stab the... Use a sword and sage on the tablet. Let's try stabbing it. That'd be good or bad. <laughs> Surprisingly, it penetrates a stone with a little effort. Is that bad? Did I do a bad? I thought that would be a good idea. It's destroying the tablet. The dagger destroyed the tablet. That's good, right? Better take the dagger so I can use it. So it can't be used against me. Cool. What's the other? Oh, the painting. Have I got to, have I got to like, oh, do I stab the painting? Or would that just strength, strengthen it? What would I do? Uh, confront, no. Well, no, I don't want to put salt and sage around the painting. Stab it. Boom! Is that good or bad? Wait, that wasn't what the book said to do. Which means, <laughs> oh, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, okay, that was wrong. That was wrong. But use this precise. That's not right. Come on then. <laughs> Fine. Fine. What? Oh no, that's not what I, I meant to confront Edgar. That's it. It's, yeah, Sage and Soul was a bad idea because that's used for protection, isn't it? What? I don't even know what the hell I'm saying. Exorcismus. Oh, exorcism. I don't know what I am saying in Latin right now. Spirit has has been now exercised from the, just the painting. Eve Eve haunts his portrait, so I'll have to banish her from the vessel. Confront the spirit. Now burn. Banish you from this vessel. Cool. Burn. Whoosh. Doesn't seem to work yet because it's not set on fire. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> what? <laughs> so 
So I got that wrong again. Fucking. Let's try the one I haven't tried. You, Sage. Sage and Salt should purge the energy from the painting, forcing Eve to find another vessel. Cool. You take a handful of salt from your backpack and apply it to the top of the frame. Did that work? You take a handful of sage from your backpack and draw a pantogram on the painting. Boosh. You missed a bit. This book is a remaining source of energy within the room. Do I burn it? I've got to banish it before Atherton regains its strength. Regains his strength. How do I do it? Recite the spelling. Tam titum pom pom shalal badum bum spiritum pala hum bum dum bum bum badum bum bum. Scumbity bum 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 Squibbity bum 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 That's my Latin. Sorry. I don't know how to speak Latin. Have a scudum bum 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 You sage. You salt and sage in the book. You pour a circle of salt around the book. Then you draw a pentagram or a pentagram of burnt sage. Okay. And then stab the book. Skabooshki. Go on. Boom. Go on then. Bingo, bango, bango. Woo, woo, woo. I'm doing good. The book's burning. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Are you going to show up? Whoa. Whoa! Now, now you shall deal with me directly, directly and all the powers, powers of hell at my disposal. Hi, you look lovely. <laughs> Does that work on you? Nope. You were thrown in the hallway by a supernatural force. Well, duh. Stop saying the obvious. So what, what, what do I do? What do I do? <laughs> Run. <laughs> Does the light work on him? Run. Okay, run, run, run. Can I get out of here? No, come on. Okay, so what do I do? What do I do? Take him out. Couldn't see him. Couldn't see him there. Die, 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 die. Okay, there we go. So I need to get him in front of me. You return to the centre of the cellar. Okay. Why the centre? The dagger hasn't destroyed the book yet. So he'll be back soon. So what do we do now? Gotcha! So I do I just need to fend him off until it destroys the book? The room is speed. Woohoo! Oh, 
achievement unlocked is that thing has nine lives. It just spent them all. The tiny of is destroyed. Thank fuck. Um, blood is gushing from the ceiling. Oh, God. I'll take the dagger with me and put it in a faraway place. Okay. Isn't that, would that be a bad thing? You take the dagger and put it in your backpack. I wouldn't take it with me. Actually, would you? Because if you leave it here, then someone else can take it and do something. But if you take it, do you investigate achievement unlocked? Yay! Um, but if you take it with you, then could you have something? Could it do something to you? I don't know. Open. I can leave the cellar now. With Edgar gone, the energies keeping keeping the main manor door closed should be should have will have dissipated. Good. I'll call a cab and get back home. The first thing tomorrow morning, I am resigning from Wallace Paranormal Investigations. That's a good idea, I think. The manor certainly feels different. Feels clean. That's a good thing, isn't it? Huh. There's a large book on the dining room table. That book wasn't there when I first came in the room. Start starting date on December thirtieth, nineteen twenty-five. These expenses over Edgar's purchase after Mary and his death. Hmm. This guy threw some pretty some. Some pretty extravagant parties. He also paid off the local authorities. Really? Why? These last two entries. That's not po it's not possible. Oh god, what's happened? The second to last entry. A cheque for 250,000. Payable to Wallace. Whoa! What? Ba -da -da -da. Post dated August and the last entry a check for a million dollars paid to the same people. It's today's da today's date. I have to get out of here now. <laughs> Why? Why? What's gonna happen? Whoa! How? Who's that? It could be any of them. video please give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already and check out more of the videos of this of curse if you did like this one and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye -bye.